Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am super excited about today's video because I'm going to be covering 50 digital product ideas that you could sell on Etsy, amongst other platforms like Shopify, or even your own website. Now, if you already follow me, you know that I love to make passive income with digital products. I also have an Etsy course where I teach you how to make printables and how to make digital products to sell on Etsy. In addition to that, the course teaches you how to start a successful store from beginning to end, from how to use Etsy SEO, how the Etsy algorithm works, how to use email marketing, and how to grow using Pinterest, social media, and other platforms. If you're interested in learning more about my course, where I teach you how to make passive income, make sure that you find the link right below this video, and it will take you to the sales page where you can view all the information and everything that comes included. So let's go ahead and get started on this video. And don't forget, if it's your first time visiting my YouTube channel, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Now, I wanted to talk about the benefits of selling digital products before we dive in into the different product ideas. Now, selling digital products online is a fantastic, low-cost, minimal-risk way to run your own business and be your own boss. And the great thing about digital products, you only have to make the product once. You don't have to worry about physical inventory sitting around. You don't have to ship anything out. Um, you earn passive income even while you sleep, high margins and low cost business to get started. So there's many benefits of selling digital products. And I'm gonna be sharing with you 50 digital product ideas for you to kind of get an idea of the different products that you could sell on Etsy. So let's go ahead and get started. So our printables is the one that majority of people, when they think about digital products or printables, this is what they think about. And this is a great, great area to go into and make passive income, selling all sorts of different types of art printables. Another product that you could sell is wedding invitations. I actually have a store that's all about weddings. And these actually do really, really great. It's one of my top stores, and I highly recommend it. And you could create wedding invites for all sorts of different themes, and people actually buy them. They edit themselves, and they go and print them out themselves, which is really great. Finance planners are really big, and these are evergreen content or evergreen products, excuse me, that you could sell year after year. Um, and that's the great thing about finance planners or pretty much any type of planner that you want to sell. Another product that you could sell is stock images. They do really, really well. I actually buy a lot of stock images on Etsy for my social media, for my blog, for my email list, and much more. So I use it for all sorts of different projects for my own business. Baby shower printables are very popular as well, especially the games, because people get a whole bunch of different games for only like $5. And majority of these are customizable. So if you wanna add your colors or your names, you could also do so, which is really, really great. So baby showers is another evergreen product because people are having babies all year round. So this is a great market to get into. Printable wedding signs is another great market. I sell wedding signs as well. And these are all sorts of different wedding signs, uh, for examples for you guys, that you could sell on Etsy. Printable funeral signs also do well. I actually have an event store. In that store, I actually sell a little bit of everything. And I actually have a section for funeral signs, programs, and other things related. And they actually do really well, especially because you can't really get a funeral sign nowhere else. They're very hard to come by. And if you could go to Etsy and get a beautiful sign for your loved one, why not, right? And you can make someone say, um, I usually, when I get these orders, I give them something for free because of the occasion, right? So um, it's just a nice touch to do, but they do really, really well on Etsy as well. And it's something different also. Printable stickers. And you'll be surprised. Like many people say, what? Printable stickers? How does that work? Well, the person buys the stickers from you. They download the file and they print it on, on sticker paper. 
that they buy at Office Depot. And I have purchased printable stickers. I use a lot of stickers uh, for some reason. I think I'm 15 sometimes, but they actually sell on Etsy. So this is a really great market to go into. Coloring pages are really big right now, especially because of the pandemic. A lot of kids are home and parents are buying some of these. I actually bought the dinosaur ones in the screen that you see for my son Jordan because he's obsessed with dinosaurs. But they actually print out really well. I print it out from my home printer and it's good to go. Photo filters. So if you are good with filters, this is very popular. People like myself will buy photo filters for maybe my social media, for my photos to have a cohesive look. Um, they have all these different types of photo filters that they sell. And you can use these uh, for your photography, for social media, for um, your blog and anywhere else that you promote um, your own photos or other people's photos. Snapchat filters are very popular. I sell these as well for my wedding and party events. I, I add that as a relevant item to my products. They do really, really well. There are stores that sell only Snapchat filters only. And then there are stores like me that have it with the additional products. So I'll create a robust line of like wedding invites, wedding sign, table numbers, and then the Snapchat filter that goes with that line. You could do that as well. It really depends on what you prefer, but they're very fun to create and people actually use them. So this is a great way to make passive income as well iPhone digital invites are huge right now because it's easy. You just create the invite. The person downloads the invite. They text it to all their friends. They save a lot of money from printing. And it's just an easy, fun way to invite someone to a graduation, a birthday party, a wedding party, a wedding engagement party, whatever you're inviting them to. But these are some examples that you could see on the screen. And they're very, very popular. Another one is printable business cards. I know personally from myself, I have purchased a lot of printable cards over the years online. And the last one that I purchased was actually from an Etsy seller. Um, so these are easy to do because you just buy the file, you edit yourself, and then you just take it to your local printing service and they print it out for you. So you, will, you could create this, you could create a whole, um, store for just business cards or a whole store that you sell um, items for businesses, right? Different types of things that they might need. Birthday printable cards. I mean, who doesn't go to Etsy to buy something like this that's unique, that's very different, that they could personalize and put their name. So birthday cards are a huge hit on Etsy. There's a lot of people that sell it within their other products in their store. And there's a lot of people that just have it very niche down and they just sell all types of different birthday cards. It really depends on what you want to do. Crochet patterns. So this is another great way to um, sell your patterns, especially if you know how to crochet. As you can see, these are some different examples. Um, you could get these hats over here to the left for $249. You could get the pattern to create that beautiful hat. And people actually buy this. So if you already selling hats and selling different types of stuff on Etsy, you can actually sell your pattern on the side and make extra money. Why not, right? You could actually sell that. So take advantage of it. Printable calendars is huge on Etsy as well, especially in the beginning of the year, like December, January, and February, you will sell a tons of them. I used to add these a lot to my store and I used to sell them all the time. They're a little technical to do, and that's the only reason why I removed them. I'm not the best when it comes to creating them. However, when I did create them, I sold a lot of them. So they do work. Knitted patterns is very similar to crochet patterns. The same thing, if you already knitting items on Etsy or you know how to knit, um, you could actually sell your patterns on Etsy and just make passive income because the customer just buys the pattern and you just make money over and over and over every single time you sell it. So why not? Baby invitation printables. This is another one. I mean, people are having babies, like I mentioned earlier, year round. Um, people want to buy something unique, something different that they can't get nowhere else. And also something personalized. Sometimes you could add the picture of yourself to it. So these are some examples. But baby invitations are very popular when it comes to selling on Etsy. 
Printable business planner is another great one. Um, if you know how to create printables, uh, excuse me, if you know how to create planners, you can make all types of planners. Business one is really huge on Etsy, especially for people like me and you that are entrepreneurs. We might want to come in here and buy a business planner to scale our business to the next level, to be more organized, um, depending on our business, right? And depending on what you're looking for. But this is a really good niche to go into as well. Wedding planners are huge on Etsy as well. Um, this goes really well if you already have like a wedding store. You can add this as an extra product in your store. And a lot of people are buying like checklists of all the things that they need to get ready for their wedding. So this is a great idea to make passive income on Etsy. Printable workbooks. I mean, another great idea. You could create a workbook just about any type of topic out there. And a lot of people buy these, especially in the beginning of the year, whether it's for their health, whether it's for um, their finance, their business, etc. There's a workbook for just about any topic out there that you could create and make money from, especially if you are really good at, at a certain topic. Flashcard printables. These are very popular. I have bought a couple of these for my son also that I have printed out at home. And this is a great way to make passive income. If you are a teacher and this comes natural to you, I highly recommend doing this. Like just putting up a store with a whole bunch of different um, flashcards and learning stuff for kids, especially because of the pandemic right now. Website themes is really big. Um, so you are, if you are a website developer, this is a great platform to go into. You could sell your website themes and then you could sell additional items that go with the website as an upsell in your Etsy store. Backdrop printables are really popular. I sell these as well for my wedding and also for my event parties. And you can make a backdrop printable for just pretty much any type of niche, whether it is a birthday, whether it's a wedding, an engagement party, um, there's all sorts of different backdrops that you could actually make. And people buy these, you send them the file, and they print it out with a different company. So it's very easy to make as well. Thank you cards um, are very popular as well. Um, and with thank you cards, you can make a card just for any type of niche as well. It could be a thank you card for a wedding. It could be a thank you card for um, a gift, a birthday party. It could be a thank you card just because you want to send someone a thank you card, right? But they're very popular as well. Another product that you could sell are clip arts. People buy clip arts. I buy tons of clip arts for my digital products. I buy a lot of them on Etsy as well. So this is another way to make passive income on Etsy. You create the product once, you upload it to your Etsy store, and you sell over, over, and over. Printable labels is another great one. So any type of printable labels that you could create for any type of business. Um, as you can see, there's different variations of printable labels on this screen. Um, so if you know how to make these stuff, you can make a whole store for printable labels for businesses or printable labels for weddings. It just really depends on your niche. Graduation invitation is another big one. Um, you could create all sorts of graduation invitations with the person's picture on it, without their picture. But keep in mind that majority of these are instant download, meaning the customer buys, they download the file, they edit the file themselves, and they print it out themselves, which is really nice because that's the definition of passive income when you do little amount of work. You're going to put in a lot of work in the beginning, creating the product, promoting your store, growing your brand. All of that does take a lot of work. However, once you have the product up, you could sell it over and over and over again, which is really amazing. Instagram templates is another one. So if you are maybe a social media manager, you know how Instagram works, you know what type of templates work really well, you could actually create a whole store of different Instagram templates for different types of businesses if you want or for a specific niche. But that's another market that you could go into. Pinterest templates are really big on Etsy as well. A lot of people prefer just to buy a bundle of templates that they don't have to do anything else. 
they just buy them and then just edit and, and use and that's all they have to do so this is another one that you could start selling on Etsy planner inserts are very very popular um, anything with planners is very popular on Etsy um, the key is to create something that solves your audience problem and it's something that's very unique and different to everyone else so therefore your product stands out in a saturated market and it becomes a no-brainer for them to buy from you. Um, but planner inserts actually do really, really well on Etsy as well. Party props. You'd be surprised when people buy party props, print them out, and they cut them themselves at home. Why not, right? It saves you money sometimes because you could buy a whole bunch of them for just like $6. Like this one to the left, you get 25 of them for only $6. That's relatively really cheap to be honest and then you could just print them at home cut them out and then just be creative and put a little stick to them so they sell and do really well and you could add this to your party event store my party event store i do sell party props as well bullet journals are very popular so like planners and journals are really big on xc people buy them year round they do ex really well because they're evergreen products so if you know how to create these, these are great to sell on Etsy. Resume templates, <laughs> these are really good, it's especially if you have like a business store where you help people um, with their business or get situated with a job, you can actually sell this in that particular store. Um, but they're really great. People buy them, they could edit themselves, they add all the information. You don't do anything, you're just selling the file and they do all the work them themselves. Kids learning games, these are all printable games that you could buy. And once you buy it, you could print it from home and you could, your kids could use them. And because of the pandemic, this is actually growing on XC huge. This year, I think is the biggest market for it that I have seen it. I have done extensive research on it before because my husband is a teacher and I was thinking of doing a XC teacher store and I never did it. And now I was like, oh, I should have done it. So <laughs> this is a really good market to kind of go into um, if, you, if you know how to make them as well. Wellness principles are huge as well because of self-care, taking care of your fitness, um, taking care of your mental state. We all need that, especially with this pandemic and COVID and everything that's happening around us. So this is a really good niche if you're really good at it you know how to create these printables, I would definitely say try it as well. Printable gift tags, this is another big one. And you could create gift tags for all sorts of events, right? You could do them for wedding, for Christmas gifts, for birthday gifts, uh, for any type of gift that you offer, um, an occasion as well. So if you already have like a wedding store, you could add printable gift tags to your store and then you could add the wedding planner that we just talked about like the little checklist so you could have a niche store where you sell one particular um let's say just like wedding stuff and then have a robust line of different products that go within within that product so this is another way great way to make passive income on xc printable stationery this is another one um, I absolutely love stationery. I'm old school. I'm all about writing on paper. I'm all about having notebooks. I'm the queen of notebooks at my home. So stuff like this, I actually do buy. I know everyone is digital nowadays. They have the iPad. I prefer stuff like this. So for someone like me, um, I'm your perfect um, target audience. But they actually sell and do really well on Etsy as well. mom planners is another big one um especially because a lot of people are at home now some people are not working unfortunately because covid and they have all different types of mom planners from like a family binder that you could buy or home management so they have all these different things and they do really well they're great for not only for yourself if you're a mom but also if you buy it for someone else as well and they have all sorts of different um, planners that you could buy um, for yourself, for your children, to manage them, etc. SVG files are huge as well. A lot of people are buying these, right, to use for their products. Obviously, 
you know, don't make sure that you don't use Disney stuff. I see some here that I took a screenshot of. Make sure that is your original art um, work and not something that is copyrighted. But SVG files do really well on XC as well. Fonts do really well. So if you are into cal calligraphy and you know how to create fonts, this is a really good niche. I am always buying new fonts for my business, um, not only to use on XC, but also to use outside of XC. So they do really well on XC. Digital paper is really popular. Um, digital paper is really cool because people buy them for all types of different projects. I buy digital um, paper to do um, wedding invites and to put that, that digital paper on the back of it and to do stuff like that. So they, they actually sell really, really well on Etsy. So if you know how to create them, um, it's an easy one to do and you sell them over and over and over. You don't have to do anything else once you upload it. Printable quotes is another popular one. This is actually how I started my Etsy journey. When I first started in October of 2016, I was selling quotes, um, black and white quotes, just like the ones that you see on the screen. And it, to be honest, my first month I sold, I made about $102 and I was doing pretty good with them. So they actually work really, really well as well. Baby announcement is another big one. It's really similar to like baby invitations, but baby announcements are great. People love buying them. They want to put their cute baby in the picture and send that out to their family and friends. And this is a really good niche to go into. Pretty much anything baby related is really, really great if you're interested. But this is another digital product that you could create or add to your other digital products that is passive income. Printable address labels. So if you want to create address labels for all sorts of different occasions, weddings, um, Christmas, Thanksgiving, fall, um, whatever you want, you could actually make them and sell them. And then people will buy them. And then they will print it at home on sticker paper so they could get that peel from the back. And it's really neat to buy them. I have bought some from Etsy as well. Printable bookmarks are really popular as well. Um, you can make all sorts of different bookmarks. You could make some with, I have bought some with positive affirmations on them. You can make them for kids. You can make them for Christmas season to give out. It's just whatever you want but they're very popular on Etsy as well. Printable banners are very popular as well. These are really cool because especially now, you know, you, you don't, can't go outside. Maybe you want to, somebody's birthday, you want to decorate the house. It's an easy way to buy something that won't cost you a lot of money that you could just print at the comfort of your home, not even have to leave your home. And they're beautiful. A lot of these stores do a really great job at creating these beautiful designs. Kiss wall art is really popular as well. I have purchased a whole bunch of wall art for my son's room that I print out and do myself. So they work really well. I also printed out some and then uploaded the file to mixtiles.com. I don't know if you guys ever purchased from there. And I created some cool frames from them. So this is a great way to purchase something that somebody buys instantly from you. You make passive income. And you could create a whole niche around kids and wall art and add all these different products for kids. This is a one that many people don't know about. I just wanted to throw it in there. Social distancing sign. Um, this is a great idea, especially because there's not that much competition in this particular niche. You could create all sorts of different signs for social distancing. And you could create signs for baby showers, signs for weddings signs for church events, signs for funeral events. You, I mean, I'm almost tempted to open a store with social distancing. That's how great of an idea this is. Mockups is another one. And mockups, you know, are great for Etsy sellers like me and you. And just in general, if you have a small business, um, because a lot of times we do have to buy mockups to showcase our artwork or our printables or our digital products or t-shirts or whatever we want to showcase. So mock-ups is another digital product that you could sell on Etsy and make passive income. So these are all the 50 different products 
that you could make on Etsy to make passive income. And I hope that this video is going to motivate you to go into digital products. It seems a lot harder, but actually it's so simple. Once you do one product and then you keep doing it, you're, you're going to say to yourself, I should have done this a long time ago. Keep in mind that, like I mentioned earlier with digital products, you make passive income while you sleep. Um, it does take some work because you do still have to build a brand. But when you do it the correct way and you know what you're doing and you create something fun, it will get easier and easier and you'll start making passive income. There's no shipping. It's very easy to get started. The cost is very low. So it's a lot of benefits of starting your very own digital store. So guys, if you're still interested in learning more about starting your very own digital store, don't forget to check out my link right above this video where you can learn more about my Etsy course. And if you enjoyed this video, let me know in the comments below. If you have any questions about any digital products, let me know and I'll be more than happy to at least point you the right direction of how to get started. And thanks for watching.